If you've been through Payson Park recently, you may have noticed large metal containers near the hill. Maybe you've seen an artist painting one. Those artists were selected from Eco Maine's Recycling is a Work of Art contest, and the containers will be used for single sort recycling, and the artists are making them more eye-catching. Photojournalist Jake Richards talks with some of the artists behind the designs. I like the process. So I almost don't want to finish it, but I, at the same time, I have to. So much fun to work really big and get to be outside. It's still super nice out. It's like following the energy of the space that I'm trying to fill out. It's for Eco Maine. It's one of their silver bullet recycling containers, and they do a contest. Um, for artists to submit designs and if you get chosen you get to paint one. In addition to, uh, to making these cans uh, you know really eye-catching it also helps to promote recycling. I've been doing a lot of honestly caterpillars and kind of butterfly related stuff. Uh, our recycling is a work of art contest is really designed to increase public awareness of sustainable recycling in in Maine. I'm Matt Grondon I'm the director of communications and public affairs at Eco Maine. We put out uh, put out a call for artists to uh, to you know put public art uh, and recycling together, and hopefully uh, that draws some interest. <laughs> so I do hope that people take the time to stop and check it out and look at it a little bit closer than just throwing their recycling in there. And maybe they'll look at the posters and learn more about recycling, make sure they're recycling the right stuff. And I hope it just brightens their day a little bit to see some public art around. My name is Bailey DeBias. I'm originally from Carabasset Valley, Maine, and now I live um, in downtown Portland. And it's always just nice to be in a collaborative space um, with other artists. But this is the biggest thing I've ever done. It sounds like all of ours are fairly different, so it'll be fun to see how they all turn out. My name's Victor. Yeah, I just, I don't know, the, my approach and my style is a little stream of consciousness. I just kind of go with the flow. I would love it to be local so I can go check it out sometimes and maybe family and friends can go see it too. That would be cool if I get to see it and people around here that I know get to see it. But honestly, anywhere it ends up, I'll be happy and I'll go find it and maybe other people can go find it if they want to. Yeah, I hope it adds value to whatever space it ends up in. It's really, I like doing art for myself, but it's cooler knowing that it's like a part of something that people will get to enjoy somewhere. EcoMaine's Matt Grondon says once finished, these containers will be moved from Portland to where EcoMaine offers other services in Maine. Four artists won the competition this year. Each artist received a $500 stipend and was reimbursed $500 for supplies. It's quite a canvas to work on. Yeah, yeah, very interesting.